Hi, so in this video, we are going to discuss NumPy arrays. So let's start by executing this code inside IPython notebook. So I have Jupyter version installed. So type in Jupyter notebook. This should open IPython on your browser. Okay, now click on new, then click on Python 3 notebook. Now here, type in import numpy adds np. After that, first we will create an array by typing a equals to np.array inside this method we will create rank one array or you can say single dimensional array so i have these three values that i'm going to print out on ipython console go to cell and click on run okay as you can see the output displays one dimensional or rank one array now what if you want to have two dimensional array in such case go inside array method and add one more square bracket end it with one more and then add one more value for second level of array so we have these rank to array which we are going to print out on the screen click on cell and then run so as you can see this is two dimensional or rank two array if you want to know the shape of this then simply print out print within print method type a dot shape this should show you it is two dimensional array showing 3 by 2 matrices so this is rank 2 with three columns within your array or you can say your mattress okay so we will strictly use the word array here instead of matrices okay so after this we will go ahead and add one more value set and going to make this three dimensional array. So let's run this again. So here you will find three by three, rank three array. Okay, so it has value one, two, three, two, four, six, and five, six, seven. Now, if I want to print individual values, then I have to use print method and then specifically mention the value starting from 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, and 8. Let's print out A0, then print out A5, and then let's say A7. Click on cell and then run. Okay, so it shows you index error because we used index 5 which is out of bound for axis 0 with size 3 so for each axis it is restricted to 3 so 0 1 2 3 4 5 so if you want to use fifth then use axis 1 value 2 if you want to use this axis 2 value 2 and now we can print it out as you can see it printed out our values it printed out 6 and 7 as well okay so after that we will also take a look at updateation of value 
here I want to change the value of a1 to let's say 4 and now we will print our array again okay so let me remove his and let's run the cell again and you will find that value of a1 is changed into 4 so you will find 4 here can change this to find out where exactly the value was changed and you'll find it was changed so this was a0 a1 a2 okay can specifically mention a1 1 equals 2 3 and you will find only that value is changed can also go for 2 and you will find only that value will be changed so you have to adjust the value for that accordingly so in short now you know how to work with simple arrays with the help of numpy first checked single dimensional array then two dimensional and then three dimensional we also checked how to find out how many dimensions your array has with the help of dot shape also we checked how to update values of your array and how to print out individual elements within the array.